Alrighty, hey there. So, I just wasted about two hours doing something stupid that I think deserves making a video on so that other people don't do the same thing, wasting all kinds of time over nothing. So, first of all, kawaii kawaii jahi-sama. Uh, but moving on. So, I was trying to put a new set of clothing on a model. Uh, where are we at? Just do it this way then. So I'm going into PMD, right? And I'm trying to load up the model so that I can switch out the clothing. And it's this model by, uh, it's like a Chinese character, but it's Lan underscore FL. Makes really good Tokisaki Kurimi models, but when I try to load it up, it will load some of this, but the actual image doesn't come up anywhere. It's not there. When you go to the materials, the materials didn't load either. But when I go into Blender, it does load up. So you'll see. Get rid of that. Get rid of the camera. Get rid of the light source. And I import it with MMD tools. Doesn't even show the characters, but that's fine because I know what it is and where it is. And so you'll see fairly famous, well-known Kurumi model. Very, very, you know, likable. And so I go all the way into the details of the mesh, and there are so many nodes, and so I'm just going through. Whoops, not trying to do that. But I just, you know, select it. I end up in edit mode. Just selecting pieces, deleting vertices, making sure I know which vertices I can delete and which ones I can't, you know, because you get different layers of stuff that's still there left behind. So I'm going through and end up being it ends up being horrible. You know, I can't really see what I'm deleting here except for, you know, a few of them. But I don't know what any of this means. So I get something just absolutely terrible and I export it. And I called it unfortunate because it really was very unfortunate. You'll see. There you go. Very not your favorite thing to see. It's okay, but having the hair missing gigantic gaps. Uh, the model was designed that way, so you can't really do anything about that. But you know, that's still left behind, a few artifacts here and there. And so I think to myself, well, what the heck, like, the original doesn't load in, right? So once again, proving I can't see anything and there's no materials. But just try out, just to see what would happen if I imported it into Blender and then exported it with MMD tools just as is. Sure enough, it comes out just perfect. I don't know why, but you can, even if the PMX doesn't load in to PMDE at first, if you import it into Blender and then export it, it will correct that issue. Not only will it correct that, it's got all the right materials, you see there's all 22 of them, and they're truncated there on my screen, so you can see them better this way. But you, they have all the right names. Even though Blender doesn't load the names, apparently it doesn't change them into rectangles. Like you get all the right stuff. So you've got Ifu, you've got. Well, I'm switching to Japanese, but Meh. Hidari Gan, Migi Gan. So you've got all the right names for everything and the model loads perfectly so lesson learned is don't spend two hours botching the whole thing horribly when you can just import it to MMD tools or import it to blender with MMD tools export it again and get it just fine and then you can just pop on in here and be like oh I want to get rid of this 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 
highlight the whole thing. Uh, shift delete this and voila it's done and it's done perfectly don't have to worry about botching up vertices here and there and you know so yeah that's what I spent two hours wasting my time figuring out hopefully it ends up better for you all <laughs>